What's up design family and welcome back to another episode of the office expansion. This is a mini series that we've been running where we've been taking you through the ins and outs of our office expansion. We've been in our current design studio for the last two to three years. And honestly, ever since the middle of last year, we've been eyeing up this space, which is pretty much next door to our current space. And it would allow us to almost triple our office space. So it's been an exciting journey and I wanted to document it personally for our team to kind of show where we've been and where we're going and ultimately something we can look back at in a couple of years. And I know some of you are personally interested in growing your own businesses. So this is a little bit of an insight into the trials and tribulations, a little bit of updates. This is the first time this week that we get to see the two spaces finally open up together. If you guys have seen the last episode, that was an episode where we basically took a hammer and broke down the wall that was separating both of these spaces. And now finally we get to see this thing open up and it gives us a glimpse into what this space is going to look like and how it's going to actually push our current space. So super exciting. And with that, that meant that we could finally start to lay out these beautiful porcelain slabs. So interesting story about these slabs. We had them at our current space. And since we built our current space three years ago, they're actually extremely difficult to find. And funny enough, those slabs ended up costing us a good amount more than they originally did because we had to buy them from one space. They kind of sensed that we need them and they, let's just say they exhausted that opportunity. Unfortunately, these are the things that you deal with. We're very lucky to have them. We actually just got enough in and yeah, we had to deal with that, but they're here, they're being laid out and they look beautiful. And then our additional files that we're gonna have in our photo shoot studio also came in today. Uh, in the bathrooms, all that stuff is all tiled up, looking beautiful, and the guys are doing a great job. I can't take you in, but right now what they're focusing on is cutting the tiles, making sure they are pristine, making sure everything's level so that when you run your foot across the tile, you don't feel any ledge and it's beautiful and it's a completely flat surface. So that's what they're focusing on. It's a very tedious, but very kind of meticulous job. We also had an issue where when we broke the original wall, we had the existing tiling that needed to be custom cut because it wasn't quite straight. And again, these are the things that you notice on site, but the guys here are doing an amazing job. And the second part of this week's kind of episode was we got to visit the factory that are actually putting together all of our custom builds. So if you look here, this is a space that's ready to receive this beautiful custom build couch that we're making that has storage in it. And again, it's just one of the many pieces that we've custom designed to enhance the space, to give our team a better experience and to just really bring this thing to what it can be. So we got the chance to visit the factory, to see all of the main pieces, how they're making them, to see the guys working on them. And honestly, they're doing such a phenomenal job. Hopefully by the end of this or the end of next week, we'll start to see even more progress. But this has been a mini update on where we're at. We're gonna cut to some amazing burials of what we've done this week and hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Also, tune in next week. We'll be back to our regular viewing with some amazing educational content on all things sports or design. So tune in guys. And again, thank you so much for tuning in to this episode of Fit Design TV. Until next week, stay awesome.